Most HR people will agree when things are not working out for an employee that somebody knew during that employee's probation period that things weren't working out or that they felt unable to give the employee the direction and feedback that they needed in order to be successful. Most line managers will agree that having engaged in an expensive and time-consuming recruitment process, they really need and really want their new recruit to get up to speed and to be successful. I'm Julia Rowan and this year my presentation to the Legal Island Conference is on how to maximise the return on investment and minimise the risk of probation. At that session we'll be looking at best practice for setting up your new recruits for success and answering questions like how do you set up a really good working relationship so that both parties know what to expect and that both parties feel able to engage in giving honest and constructive feedback? How do you strike that important balance between giving the new recruit direction and supervision and allowing them to work on their own initiative? And how do you formally manage the probation process? So whether you are a line manager or whether you support line managers, this session will be packed full of tips and techniques and useful tools that you can take away to use both with new recruits, but also with any employee who's in transition. And it's a very complete session because we'll be joined by solicitor Julie Austin, who will be dealing with the legal aspects of managing probation.